Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel and welcome to this video which is going to be about how to create a thank you page with Kartra. Uh, I'm Marissa Romero and if you haven't already, go ahead and smash the subscribe button if, um, if you haven't done so because I'm going to be uploading tons of videos like this. And um, in this video, it's a follow-up video to the last one I made which is the link of that video is in the description so you could go back and watch but it's about how that was about how to create a landing page or your squeeze page so this is the second step is creating your thank you page so um, and right now it's still in the as of today March 28th it's still in the pre-launch phase for Kartra but as soon as it releases um, you can grab it with uh, the link in the description below and get access to Kartra and there's like tons of first time bonuses for signing up and I could talk about that later. But anyway, let's um, go back to where we were. We made a landing page. Um, we found a product in the marketplace of Kartra and it has to do with the weight loss niche. We found a product to promote. We created a squeeze page around it. And now we're going to create a thank you page. so that whenever your um, visitors opt in, they have somewhere to go. Okay, so we're back here at My Pages. Remember the last video we created this one, How to Lose Weight Without Cutting Good Foods. So now we're gonna go to Page, click on Thank You Page, and we're gonna keep it simple. I think there was a simple template here at the bottom that I liked, and yeah, here it is. We're gonna, we're gonna select this one and launch the builder for this one. So we're going to call it um, weight loss thank you page. So it's easy. And category we have weight loss. All right, so create. And as it loads up, I like this uh, thank you page because it is very simple. And um, if you want to add stuff to it, this is a good opportunity for you to add different components to it, which is kind of cool. So right here, as you can see at the top, you can add your logo. It says thank you. It has this little, you know, check mark symbol here, here, and um, you have your call to actions down here. So let's just start with. Uh, I'm not going to add a logo, so we could delete that. Um, what we could do is move this arrow up here oh wait let's try to move it if not we can add a picture to that top part there we could add a component um let's see what if we wanted to add like a video so we can add a video here because what if you wanted to add like a little thank you video to your page this is a really great place um, to put it and you can even add like a little headline above that text headline um, so yeah what's like a good simple one here now let's use this one we could add this above there there so yeah whenever the way you drag and drop here is whenever the um, the little yellow lines turn green, that means it's good to go and you can place it there on the page where you want it. So let's rename this title to um, thank you. I'm trying to get the little text to pop up. So, please check your email oops, to access the information. Okay, um, and we're going to make this a little bit smaller. And let's just change this to black and white. We'll keep it simple. Oops white and we want black 
And we'll make it a little smaller so it could be on one line. There. That's better. Okay. So here, do we need this? Please check your email. And you could say, oops, say something like about the, about the video below, like watch this video to find out what to do next. And we'll make it italicized and maybe a little bit smaller. And we'll also, let's, let's put this at like a blue or something like that. So thank you. Make this smaller too. Doesn't need to be that big. See 1.4, oops. Yeah, that's better. Thank you. Mm, yeah, let's just stick to black. Okay. So now, oh, maybe that's why it needs to be a little bigger. Okay. So now we will, I'll show you how to add a video to this um, placeholder here. So you can add a video and a link to YouTube. Um, so you just click on this little edit button and click on YouTube and then what, grab whatever link you want from YouTube and then just put it right there in the, um, so I'm going to go to my YouTube and let's go to, let's just pick a, a video creator studio and let's look at one that's not going to matter. Uh, yeah, let's just get this one for fun. This was back when I had long hair. <laughs> All right, copy this video and then put it back. And autoplay, I usually don't have it on autoplay because if you don't have it on autoplay, then people are going to want to play it. So let's apply and see what it looks like when you have your video on here. Cool. So now we go down here and we already said thank you, so maybe we don't want to include this. And I don't know. I don't really want this either. It seems like too much. Oh, sorry about that. I was able to delete it. Um, <laughs> that was kind of weird. But all right, so now you could put, we can edit this little sub headline and um, we could say, you have successfully subscribed to our newsletter. You could say, um, you have successfully, or you're now on your way, you know, on your way to achieve your weight loss and fitness goals. Something cool. Um, and here you can like, you can send them to any link. You can send them to any download, really anything you want. But for the purpose of this demonstration, I like to put my social medias so that they can connect with you. And so right here, I'm going to say, um, have we connected Oops, on social media, or we could say let's connect, let's oops, connect on social media. So it's a good way to get followers and people to go to your social media pages. So I don't have Twitter. Um, but we can change this out to something that I do have. And I love Instagram. So let's put Instagram. <laughs> and I like to make this a little bit bigger, giant size, circle. For Instagram, I like just a square. So we'll put that there. And we'll change this to also giant. Circle's fine. All right, that color's fine. 
and then Google. I don't really use Google Plus, so we could do, wait, let's just do YouTube. So YouTube, I like YouTube. Um, and we could keep that red, and let's make the size giant again. Circle is fine, or no, actually, no circle for YouTube. So we'll click Apply. Cool. So now you want to put the links to your social medias here. So it's simple for each one. So the, you could just grab the link and you want it to go to a custom URL. So get the URL to your, um, you know, your Facebook or Instagram or wherever, whichever website you're sending them to. And you just grab it from your website and paste it here. And you want to make sure it doesn't have the HTTPS twice. WWW is fine, but it doesn't need HTTPS twice. So open a new tab, apply, and same thing with Insta, edit, edit the link, custom URL, and where's my Insta, there it is, copy, okay, Instagram is good, now one last one with YouTube. And my YouTube link is right here on my Instagram, so I'm just going to grab that. Copy. And link, custom URL. Boom. Okay. So now you have your social medias, which is pretty cool. Um, and I think this is fine for, oh, then don't forget to change this. All rights reserved. Um, copyright so just put like your your name or your company your LLC and um, so you can it could be complete this freedom LLC cool awesome so now we are done with the thank you page make sure you save the progress and go back to the dashboard um, so yeah now we are going to in the next video I'm going to show you how to um, Put it all together and oh I'm sorry before we do that let's go back and I'll show you how to let's publish this get the page link because we're gonna need it to connect to our opt-in form let me just show you guys this really quick so we published it and we, we're gonna return to the dashboard so that we can connect this opt-in form with the thank you page so go back to my forms so remember we created this it's in my um, how to create a landing page video so we created this opt-in form we're gonna edit it edit so that way when they opt in they they will land on the thank you page so we're gonna go save and next and then confirmation um, you want to change the success page so remember I had Google as a placeholder. We want to put this thank you page right here. And, and no, this is a Kartra page. Okay, so the category is weight loss and we want to select the page we just made. Weight loss thank you page, perfect. So confirm. Now you're all set, and now when the when your visitors opt in, they're gonna see that beautiful thank you page we just made. All right, so that is it for this video, and stay tuned for the next one on how to create an auto autoresponder and connect it all together. And um, please ref refer to the links in the descriptions for all the resources, including access to Kartra, and um, even my bonuses if you were to sign up with me. Um, for Kartra that you would get. So um, that's it for now. Once again, this is Marissa Romero. Please like, comment, and subscribe to this channel, and I will talk to you and see you on the next video.